It's a win or go home today out in Omaha at the state baseball tournament. We start in Class A. Lincoln East with a chance to be the first team from the capital city to advance to the Class A state title game since 2012. To Tal Anderson for East versus Elkhorn South. The East bats, listen, they were hot early on. Jeter Worthley, he's going to rip one deep into left center. Worthley, the Michigan commit, legs one out for a double. The Spartans playing with a 3-0 lead later. Elkhorn South threatening with the bases loaded. Connor Johnson comes out of the pen and comes up clutch. Three strikeouts in relief for Johnson to the sixth. The Storm, they get the tying run to third. The grounder to short. Joey Senstock, the future Husker, fields, fires, and saves the run at home. East clinching to a 3-2 lead. Seventh inning, Elkhorn South with a runner at third again. Johnson gets the batter swinging to end it. Lincoln East with a dramatic 3-2 finish. The Spartans advance to the state finals. They're the first Lincoln team to reach the Class A championship since 2012. I was up there, I'd come set, and my leg would like twitch. I was so nervous, but like back, back to what I said, we just believed, and I believed that we could get this done, and we did. It's a player's game, man. Our players just freaking fought like crazy, and they did enough to, to get it done versus a really good team. Good stuff from the Spartans. They become the first Lincoln team to advance in 11 years to Class A. They will face Millard West, who defeats Grand Island today 5-1. to one. Congrats to the Islanders on a fantastic year and an amazing run as the eighth seed. To Class B, Norris <laughs> fell in Game 1 to Scut 4-2 to two earlier today. It's win or go home tonight in Game 2. We pick up in the third. Titans up 5-1. to one. Jordan Monroe, he's going to squeak one out of the infield. It's enough to bring in Cody Bernards. It's 6-1 Norris. A few batters later, Titans just passing the baton along. Logan Michael beats the infield in. It's a two RBI single for Michael. Titans extend their lead to seven. Fourth inning, Scut threatening with the bases juice. But how about Kaiser Poppenhagen? A big K gets the Norris. Titans out of the jam. The senior, he goes the distance today. He also gets it done at the plate. It's an RBI for the senior who does it all for Norris today as they score 11 runs in game two. They win big to advance over Scott to advance to the Class B state title game where they'll face Elkhorn North. Our AD just asked me the same thing. If I would have told you before the season that you'd be here, would you have taken it? I was like, absolutely, man. I, of course, this is what you play for, right? And so it uh, feels awesome. Proud of these guys. Um, they've earned it. Winning's fun. I mean, doing this is fun with my brothers. It's the best, it's the best feeling ever, so it's great. From Class A to C, Malcolm, the one seed up against Platteview. The Clippers getting things going from the jump. Mason Wisniewski hammers one to the gap in right center. Two are going to come around to score. Hayden Frank slides across, make it 2-0. Malcolm, bottom half of the inning. The Trojans with an answer. Alex Draper showing off a little oppo power. This one going to roll to the wall. Platteview with plate two. In the first, it would be tight throughout the game. Five to five in the fifth, where Malcolm would retake the lead and never lose it. The Clippers, they advance to the Class C state title game with a seven to six win.